InterHealth Canada CEO Dr. Roger Chessman commented on the situation saying that though the drug was not available at the Cheshire Hall Medical Centre at the time it was requested by patients last Friday, it could have been made available from resources from the Cockburn Town Medical Centre in Grand Turk that very day had he been notified of the matter. If this person had had a short hot shoot shoot a problem of the then I, I could have, have uh, an ex exactly what I did yes I heard, heard about it. We arranged for a I in conjunction with Polly colleagues and, and that I was I was available within within hours. That person could have had that treatment a uh, uh, day day that he uh, required it had, had that person brought complaint complain to the right right place. Communication was identified as a part of the problem, and Chessman noted that this issue is also being addressed. Thank you, Carmen. I agree entirely with your statement, and I have made that observation more strongly to my senior staff, and I have told them that our staff are responsible for making sure that they have what is there, what needs to be there, and if they don't have it, then they must deal with it, not just ignore it. Now, earlier this afternoon, just two days after the airing of the story, the two dialysis patients returned to News 4 to inform us that they visited the hospital today and the drug that they needed was in fact available. For WIV4 News, I'm Joy Del Trail.